Guys, Sega Major, come back at you with a brand new Rolling Thunder video. And yes, what you are looking at, and by the title, I do have the first gold sniper on this game. And um, yeah, I don't know why it's not letting me customize. There we go. Um, I did literally spend all day yesterday going for gold with one person in the lobby. And uh, it wasn't fun, but the challenges are easy. So I'm here to tell you everything and uh, I'm showing you guys the camos right now. So we have um, Army, which is the very first camo. Mac V, Jungle Hex, Scales, Carbon, Fizz, which is, by the way, one of the best camos. Copper, Glacier is also really nice. Navy, Jester, Psycho is a really nice camo as well. And then we have Wound, Gold, which is actually really nice if you're on PC. And Slick. Slick looks really good to me on mobile, but PC, all of these camos look insane. I do not have diamond yet, but uh, that will be the next challenge, hopefully. Um, you guys know me, I'm a completionist, I like getting everything done. So, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and break these challenges down in the easiest ways that I found to do them yesterday. So, starting off with army. Army is literally just get five kills. Super easy. Mac V. So, Mac V is get six kills on enemy equipment. Now, um a lot of people aren't using equipment right now because a lot of people don't know what to do so with this you can actually go into your specialist class oh my bad you can go into your specialist class and you'll notice that your specialist has a landmine so what i was doing yesterday is i would spawn in with my specialist i drop the landmine reset myself swap my class over to marksman and then i would spawn back in with my mosin and I would shoot that equipment. And it counts for your equipment kills. So you don't have to rely on other people to do it. If people are doing it, I mean, yeah, you know, good, whatever. But you don't have to rely on other people. Next one, I believe this was get eight kills within 20 meters. So this is just getting close range kills on people. Super easy. Um, this next one is, I believe it was get uh, eight or 16 kills um from farther than 30 meters so that's just kind of your long shot kills i mean it's nothing crazy it's not hard to do it's very very simple most of these challenges are simple they just take time um carbon i believe carbon and i might be getting these uh in order wrong but i'm trying to go through all of these just so everybody has an idea of what the camos are what the challenges are and the best way to complete them so carbon i believe is get crouch kills that one's super easy all you have to do is literally just crouch and get kills um fizz i don't remember exactly but i do know that one of these is you need to get crouch or prone kills and it's a good amount i think it's like 50 or something um you have to get crouch or prone kills but when you do this the crouch kills don't actually count so whenever you get to the camo that says do crouch or prone kills just prone because when i was crouching yesterday it was not working but when i proned in certain areas it would work so if you're on a rock or something and you prone it might not count you have to be on ground level on grass it's really weird but that's how it was working for me copper i also don't remember but um i know one of these is like get a couple headshots and then later on you're gonna have to get 80 headshots for um i believe wound um and then another one is just get more close range kills and it should add the eight that you already have um so it's within 20 meters again and then another one is get more long shots which it should add the ones you already have as well so if you're constantly doing long shots and short range kills they should add up for the last camos um, the other ones are get kills while uh, hurt. So pretty much, I mean, those will come by itself. If somebody's shooting at you and you kill them while you're, I believe what I was recording is it was below half HP. If you're below half HP, then the kill will count. But I think if you're above half, then it doesn't count. So, you know, if you can try to let somebody shoot you for that. But that one's easy. I think it's only like 20 kills or something. Um, other than that. It should be pretty sim simple. All of these were really easy to do. It just takes time to do them. Especially because I bought the game and there's only a couple players. Um, yeah, other than that. So, Wound. Wound is the camo that is probably not... Is probably, I'd say, the hardest. It's not hard. It's because it takes 80 headshots. Now, 80 headshots really isn't a lot. But on this game, with how people move, how quick the movement is, and how bad the aiming 
was last night. Um, it's a little bit hard. It's a little bit difficult. So my best recommendation to get this done is try to do your headshots while you're doing these other camos because when you do these headshots, they all stack up towards the end towards wounds. So when I was done, I was at like 20 something headshots. So I only needed 60. But if I would have had more, I would have had a lot more done and I would have been able to do it. Now, gold actually has its own challenge. It's not just given to you. So it's really weird because slick basically works as if it's gold and gold just works as a normal camo. So gold is get 200 kills total. Um, but for some reason, it only counted 15 of mine yesterday. I don't know what it is. I don't know what exactly it counted, but it only counted 15. So I had to get 200 or I had to get 170, uh, 100 and 75 yeah that sounds right no 185 i had to get 185 kills yesterday that took fucking forever but slick is your reward for getting gold and yeah that is pretty much it like i said these camos are super easy they are super self-explanatory all it is is just it takes a little bit of time just remember try to do as many headshots as you can and for crouch and prone kills, you need to prone because crouch kills will not count. No matter what you do, the crouch and prone kills, camo, it only counts the prone kills for some reason. Don't know why it's like that, but hopefully CD will fix it. And um, yeah, other than that, I really hope y'all enjoy the game this weekend. If you didn't know, the game will be free from 12 in the afternoon, Eastern Standard Time. So figure out where that's at for you and you know enjoy the game hopefully i'll see you guys in the game and uh, if you see me don't forget to say what's up and come by the stream this week and we'll be streaming all weekend other than that y'all take it easy i'll see you guys next one and peace the fuck out